Hey, fruit cake, the most popular pound cake in Europe. Again, the oldest dates back to Roman time. In the 15th century, though, British began their love affair with it. Check this out. It was the custom in England for unmarried wedding guests to put a slice of the cake under their pillow at night so they will dream of the person they will marry. Wow. So what you want to do first in order to improve the flavor drastically? I'm going to make a flavored butter with crystallized ginger and some of my uh, candied orange peel. I'm going to blend half of the butter, then I'm going to transfer this mixture in the mixing bowl. I'm going to throw in uh, the remaining butter, zest and powder sugar, and I'm going to cream the whole thing. Add two thirds of the eggs gradually making sure the mixture remains smooth and fluffy. Meanwhile, sift the flour with baking powder and combine dry fruits together. Here you've got golden raisins soaked in flambe rhum, candied orange peel, red cherry berry, and tutti frutti dices and cut them with flour so then it prevents fruits from sinking when baking. Next, I'm going to incorporate half of the flour, beat on low and add the remaining eggs and flour. What a gorgeous cake batter. Not done yet, baby. Throw in the fruits and it's gonna look even better. I'm gonna use a large 20 inch long pate mold, almost two foot lined with parchment paper. Any mold would work. It is just a personal preference. I like the way it looks, the French style pound cake. So that one is gonna take an hour and 20 minutes to bake. Once completely cool, glaze the top with some apricot jam and decorate the way you wish. Be generous, make it like stunning looking cake, using more candied fruits such as mandarins, cherries, lemons, pistachio, almonds, whatever you like. I hope guys you have enjoyed this beautiful fruitcake episode. To get the full recipe, go to brunoskitchen.net. Please subscribe, like my page on Facebook and follow me on Twitter, Instagram and Pinterest at Bruno Albuz. Have a beautiful day. Ciao, ciao. Mm.